Well, yo, yo, what's up? Stangham and John here. What's going on? Look at this, Dobbs. From Sunday, trading at the highs. And I don't know if I'm sharing the right chart. Uh, let's see. I'm on a 15 minute, 20 day. Lower down the volume on this TV. TV is loud. Here we go. I'm on a 15 minute chart, 20 day. That's what I can see. We've been sweeping high, sweeping low, Dobbs. So you're going to look at the 15 minute or what are you going to do? I'm just putting a range from Sunday. So if you look at Sunday's range, like Monday, we are, we're trading all at the highs. We traded all in the range of the highs. And then going into Thursday and Friday, look how we start losing the highs here and selling off. Yep. And then the next week, our range started and we started again at the highs. Yet we start selling off some more. Yep. Now this week right here, this is actually a new week right here. So let's see. Let's see how this this correlated. Right. Well, no, this is the same week. So this is Monday. This is Friday. Right. This is the range, and we're trading at the lows. The problem with this week is that holiday. This holiday I was up here, and then today, this week, this is what we're looking at right now, and. This is one week, two weeks, and this is three weeks. This is a problem. Yep. But there's there's certain things in here that, that kind of make it seem like there's something going on. We got, what we got, Dallas? This is what we got. We got this low. We got a lower low. And a higher low. So that's what we're looking at right there. <clears throat> and let's say that into Tuesday. But that's not the first time we've had higher lows, though. So um, actually, if you look at the whole week, right? Like, look at this, right? Like yeah, Tuesday. but what I'm saying is you don't want to put too much emphasis on that higher low because we've had higher lows. No, no, what I'm saying is like. There's high, there's right, like right here, there's higher lows. Yeah, but what I'm saying is by Tuesday, look where Tuesday is at. By date and time, we made a lower low. Yep. Right here, this is Tuesday, this is the bottom of the week. Did we make, yep. Did we make any lows here? Yeah, we kind of consolidated. But look, this is the end of the week right here. And we made a new low, right? Right? Yep. So On that week, week, we consolidated. This is the last week. Monday, right? Tuesday made the low, right? So this is kind of what we did this week. We made a high on Monday. Actually, yeah, we made a high on Monday. We made which was over here was Monday, so we made the high over there. Yeah, right here. Is, oh yeah, I'm sorry. So this is the high on Monday. See, which is different than what we got in right now because we made a high on Monday. Yeah, but look, Tuesday we made a high, we made the low, and what we end up doing? Trading underneath that high. So if you look at it like this, it's half back. Yeah. We didn't get above half back. Of, so that is, is kind of. Of what? Monday I, or Tuesday? You, that's Monday. That's if Monday, If Tuesday was the low of the week, this right? is Monday. Remember, we look at Monday range. Yeah, but what I'm saying is that that look at look at the. So key. what did it do? It held half back, swept Monday range to the hot side. Yeah, but look how high we traded in the range. Failed it. Look, look how high we traded in that range. I know, but I'm just saying. Let's look at Monday range. Monday range, okay. So it swept the high side. I, I just want to. I just want to do this for the for the low high halfback sweep to the high side and then where are we going we went to the other side yep. okay so let's see what it does the following monday so right here on this monday we did this is the high so now we it's different now we got a high i need to mark it up sorry and a low and we failed we didn't even go half we, back. we didn't even get to half back no they just sold it so let's look at this week what we're possibly doing. 
Actually, this is this what is it at the end of the week? So this was just continuation. All right, so now we got a low, we got a high. Guess what? They failed fucking half that. That's why it did what it did today. I see. Yeah, we should have held here. But we got the high from Monday. Oh, low. Why can't I get the high? Half that. We got this high. Yep. This low. And this is half back. And that's half back right here failing. So what's it supposed to do? It's supposed to sweep the low. Did we not do that? Yep. And sweep we can possibly just continue down. Now when we failed that low of Monday, let's, let's look at that Monday fail. It's, it's a very dangerous area of that right now. I think they're hiding the cell. They're they're hiding the cell off. They're trying to. That's the low right there. When we failed the low on Tuesday, just continue though. All right. Yeah. Let's see when they failed the the, the range here. You know, this is Monday's low right here. Actually, look, Dobbs, that's Monday's low. That's why I came back. That area is Monday's low. Actually, this is Monday's low. Yeah, you're right, you're right. Sorry. So let's do it like that. Because that's why I went up there. Because we were at the low. No, look, Monday, right? It should have been half back right here then Wednesday. That's the half back. Yep. So what do they do? They double tapped the high side. High low half back. Failed. So they double tapped. All yeah. right. It looks pretty bad. Monday low, high. Went back to half back. Held half back and then took off. And then failed the highs. Popped this, up. Can, can this we is get Monday the, high right here, though. It's huh? Monday high. So oh, yeah, this, this is Monday, Monday high right here, right. though. And then it went to half back on Tuesday. You're right. And then it did it again. So it popped. Yep. Double dip, right. double double dip, DD, double dip. And then you had a high on Tuesday. Yep. And then you had the half bag right here. Yep. God damn it. Now, do we have that same scenario right now, though? Do we have the same scenario? High? No, we're we're it's in trouble. High, low, and half backs right here. Yeah, it's in trouble. We're taking out half back. Yep. We just took out half back. We gotta make a new loan. That's a dangerous chart right there. Actually. But we gotta count the legs. So now we got to go back and count. Yeah, because this is weird. Play. If you really look at it, that's still Monday's play right here. So did we make the is this? Nah, regardless, look, it's not it's not setting up right. This is Tuesday. We didn't make a new high. No. So we got a low high, half back, sweet, which is says sweet, the low. Yeah, that's all we have. We have that kind of move. So we got to go back down somewhere. Now, can we do? Let's see. Can can it do this? Hang on a minute. You got a two hundred EMA on your yearly. You've got marked down here. So yeah, it bounced right there. That's where it bounced. But it can sweep it and then come back. So I don't know if it's done that. Have you seen it do that? I would imagine it probably does. Let's look at it real quick. I would imagine uh, it does. I'm gonna add it real quick. It's probably got to sweep it. I, I mean, everything's got to sweep and then reclaim. So. I have a yearly, man. I know I have a yearly, man. 
We just do a regular EMA and then set it for the yearly. Yeah, do we have Exponential. You could set that for yearly? Yeah. No, nah, you can't set that for yearly. There's only one that sets it for yearly. 200. The 200. Yeah, but you can't. Yeah, but set it for the 200. You're going to set it for the 200, not the 9. The I need, so you need one that reflects the yearly. I got one that reflects the yearly. Damn. Huh? What? There it goes. This will reflect the yearly. Should have reflected the yearly. Well, I'll use the same indicator. There it goes right here. See? So that one shows the yearly. Okay. So that's the yearly bounce that we had. So maybe it's a, a dead, a cat, a cat bounce right here. Because look where it's headed. So we're definitely double bottom. We're definitely coming back down there. It looks like, I mean, why wouldn't it come down there right now? Right. I mean, make a double bottom. I'm sure there's more orders down there. They didn't get all of them. But is this our crossover on the 200 to the downside? If it goes right through it, then we're we got targets to the downside. Mm -hmm. We have we have a target at. Okay, let's go to the thing. And this could get aggressive, actually. <laughs> And there's no there's no saying right now that this isn't gonna go see a 200, and there's no saying that's gonna hold that 200. But I I think it does go see a 200 again. Does it go underneath? I'm not really sure. At that point, I won't I wouldn't I wouldn't put it I wouldn't be selling there. <laughs> right. So let me show you why the targets we have actually match up with that 200 right now. And it's probably going to hit now that I look at it. Uh, number two. Here you go. So this is us on the yearly. All right. That's us on the yearly. And we cannot get above this high. We also can't get above this halfback. And this is the monthly halfback. But our low is down here for the weekly. Can we come back to the low? Can we come back and sweep down there? Now that is at 39.53. The yearly is at 39.49. And we're below all these lows. And look at this candle. This candle rejected half back. This candle is rejected half back today. So if we're sweeping the lows and we're not holding that low, it's a possibility that we're going to go back right down to here, 39.51. 3955 area and hit that moving at moving average on a daily. 55, imagine that. 2455 and 96. 96 to 55. Yep. 96 going 54. Yep. It sounds like it right now. 55's halfback, pretty much. Exactly. And there's a weekly halfback down there that it bounced mm -hmm. off of. Now, if we don't stop there, we got targets all the way down. Yeah. We got these targets. We got this low right here to sweep and a high. So this little area is going to be it. And this kind of reminds me of that play up here, I think, when it hit here, that it bounced. And here, right, where was it? I think it was here. It was literally here. We have been in the same price level. That it was like a high right here. This high and this low, like they were hitting those highs and lows. Like right here, we hit a high and we hit those lows at the same time and bounced up. Big orders probably here. Probably to take it long from that high and that low and also take out liquidity from these guys that, that were long. And right there, it hit. The only problem we have is, is look at the date. That's the only problem we have. When we were at the lows on the 30th, we're now at the lows and it's 28. But now we're at half back though. It's different. Yeah, they, 
are they gonna sell the low right now? That's the we're low. Are they gonna sell it? That's the problem we have. So let's look at date. We're at the low. Now we're at look at date. We're at half back. We got low, we got high. Yeah, so it's still is the half back the low now. Now you got the half back. Yeah, are we gonna sell until we get to the or are we gonna go up to this half back? That's the problem. The half back's up here at seven. Oh, monthly halfback, yeah. But I'm just saying of the structure, though. Oh, that's a monthly halfback right here. Yeah, we're at halfback. So, so the highs we traded here at the highs for so long, they might have this plotted down that they're just gonna rip it up. And it's looking like a sell, but I there's another thing now it's right here. So, are we gonna sell tonight? Possibly, we are gonna sell. We're gonna you sell. You think? Yeah. We're gonna. We need. We we're here. We're right here. You see this area right here. We're right here. We did a. We did a green candle. These two green candles. We did these two green candles off the drop, right? We did a drop. One, drop, two, three. two green candles. One, yeah. two, three, right? Off the top. We actually took out a low here. We took out this low. Finally, we took out all these lows here, and then took one. I mean, I say one, two, three. Took out that low. See how we took out all those lows? This yep. candle took out all those lows. So that's the first red, second, third, right? We're in this area right here. And then we had a pop up candle. Boom, pop up. Had our second pop up candle. Boom, pop up candle. Yep. Not that big. Then we all have right. this candle. We have this candle, and then we have this candle right here. Boom. We got a, a red. A green, but the point with this candle is that look, half back tip, go to half back. We didn't go to, well that day we did go all the way high, but we went a half back on this day. And now we're doing this day right here. We took out that low. Yeah. As you see right here. Took out that low. That is an issue. The fact that we took out that low is saying that. When we take out lows, you see how we didn't take out any of these lows? But when we take out a low, like the downside, is this candle. So if we took out a low, can we have a continuation to make this candle? Because we still need a candle that goes down, and then we need one that goes up and then does this. We need something that goes down, goes up, and then does this. The last down candle has to hold. Yep, right there. Half that. We don't have that yet. No. We're still, even though we're consolidating, because look. So let's look at this. This is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. But how many candles do we have? One, two, three, four, five, six. Six candles before we got. But the time is the only problem. Yep, the time is the only problem that we're coming into before, after the 30th, they got bought. So the, look, this is after this is a weekend, then after starting the third, fourth, fifth. And we're already rolling into a month next tomorrow. So can that possibly still be a scenario that we make this candle low, it stops here, because this is the stop of it. We made a new low like this one. Can tomorrow be a big green candle? So we need this going in tomorrow, and then they can start. They can start buying start up. Start buying. Because after the 30th, they start buying up. And that's the same thing I've been talking about. Yep. So if they set the low, we should be having a half back that, that covers up, that holds up. Um, as of now, we don't have this. So can this candle have a big wake? Can we have one candle as a big wick down, then back up? Yes. But you had two two down candles too. Yeah. This is the problem, but we took out a low though. So we take out a low, they're still expecting that one move. And they could flip it though. Yeah, well, I mean that one took out a low though. But let's say let's say this so first one, we, this first one right here took out the low. It wicked and took out the low. Now, what I'm saying is a closing candle. So this candle closed lower. See how this candle's closing lower than all these lows? Yeah. This gotcha. is the only candle that closed low. Yeah. But we could possibly still wick in this candle and then come back up. 
That's why I'm thinking maybe. But look, though, is this candle going to close below this low? It's already closed. So I'm saying it's below it. So it's yeah, already did it. It already did it. Yeah. But it doesn't necessarily mean that 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 they're just going to buy it. I mean, they could buy it. That just means that we got to be mindful of this this level right here because yeah. if it gets above there, then we well, I mean, we're, we're looking to, if our setup, you know, if our setup works. 70, and we're already above there. Right now and after ours, we're already above there. And that's dangerous. We're already above that price. Yeah, but the, the problem with it is that, the problem with it is when you go back to this. So, this, you know, that's why I went to the yearly, that it still looks like downward movement because of this. Now, let, let's take the scenario of this. Let's take the scenario of this, all right? Right now, what do we have? Hi. Oh, I can't believe it did that. <laughs> I can't stand when it does that. It drives me insane, though. So let's let's take the scenario of this. Oh no, you don't. Oh yeah, you do. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to put the. Okay, let's take the scenario of this. Hi. Yep. Now is this the low for two here? Is that the low? Uh, we may not be because. I mean, is that the it, low right now? It, it doesn't problem. have to be Tuesday though. That's the thing. It could be London. It could be London or, open in the morning. Or high. I mean, low, right? High. Right now, we're structurally, we're feeling half that. You're under Sunday open, which I think that needs to be a marker too, because. Here's the thing. If we get above Sunday open price, we're gone. Because we're early in the week. Yes, we're early in the week. So Sunday open price, if we get I mean, above we're there. It, we're doing it a little bit different because Monday usually set the low. Look, so this week, Monday set the low. Actually, Tuesday didn't do nothing. This, this was a little, little sell off. There. Monday was the high. And Monday was the high. So this is the highs of Monday. Well, this is the high of Monday. Yeah, that was the high. And then we took our own loan. Monday. Monday. Yes. We did everything on Monday. Monday. Yep. And it kept going. Yep. Because of Friday. Because yeah. of Friday's range. But this was also a holiday. So they sold it that holiday. Yep. And after that holiday, look, Tuesday, continuation. And then Wednesday was the low. So, mm -hmm. I mean, realistically, if you look at this right here, this, there was no bounce in this play for this week. Mm -hmm. If you take that Monday, right? And I don't even know when they set the low. The low was, this thing was, it ain't Thursday, Thursday for the week? It was Thursday. Yeah, this, this was done all week. This thing was, was about sooner. So that's why we got to, we got to, there's a progression on what days make the lows. So you need to start marking that too. So Thursday made the low that week. This week was kind of like what we're looking at right now, but. See, and Friday made the low here. So see look, the progression. This is the difference though. Low on Monday, high, and then we made a new high on, on Tuesday. So if we're making a new low, is it the opposite of well, let's see. Let, let's see. We go up, right? We made a new low. Do we come back up to half back? Yeah, I think this is the play right here. That's probably, probably what it's going to do. It's going to go up and then reject. Because here it was bullish into the end of the week. If you see this, this was actually very bullish. If you really think about it, this is bullish. Mm -hmm. You know, all we did was was go up right but we made that when we did this move and that report came back into it we held half that yeah but you're holding friday's high that's the difference right. i don't think we're holding friday's high right now let's see i think we are still above friday oh no we aren't we're below it which is totally different but we're way below friday's on exactly so can they make a new low or make a new high? We still haven't made a new high then. And realistically, we're just, 
I don't know. It's kind of hard to say they're going to sell these low. Well, we didn't take out this high. We made a lower high. I see how it looks like that. This is this is we got a double top with a number three. So that's a, I mean that tells me right there that it's lower. We should be going lower. Yeah, right here. It at least take out. out sweep the low. Probably hit this target that we got right here. And we might bounce and hit these lows and definitely hit the yearly. Well, tough, tough one right here. I mean, for a, a swing trader, I guess. I don't know. I think we play with what it's doing. Well, okay. Now let's look at our London closed range because this is our London closed range, right? We failed the top. Yeah, it's going to swing the low now. We're at half back. So can it pop up? Yeah, but if it slices through like butter, we know that London closed range bottom right here is in play right here. Yeah, we're already below it. So say that we fail here, it's going down to the next range box to the downside. And if it goes down there, it's not saying that it, if we hit the top boxes. I think this is what we got to be playing. This is the range. So we're inside this range right here. We ain't moved since Friday. Yeah, we went above it. But I think we got to do that same move to the downside. Whatever this move was right here, projection, that's what we got to do to the downside. All right, let, let, let's do the watch for it too. So let's do, this is important, I think, as well. I think that range that if we break up to the top of our bounce of, of that candle, it's the key too. And we're below it. So look where it's going to pop up to, dog. We're not, we're failing half back right now. We're at half back of this, of this range. So we are meant to break out. That's going to be a key right here. I love where we're at. That, that is key right there. Uh -huh. See what happened on that Monday. This Monday. And that's probably what held it down too, Dobbs. You know that, right? Yep. The range to the top side, it probably could never break above it. Yep. And then once it broke below it, it broke out. It's the weekly one that we got to be more cautious of. Let's look how it looks for the rest of the week with that. Because the fact that we're sweeping back down underneath it, I think that weekly one is the one that matters the most. There it goes, breakout. Wick to it. And it's arranged to that side. So this week, how we're looking at it right now, oh, that's tough. We swept the high, we sweep the low, Dobbs. That's how I was looking. Why yep. why are we up here and we can't go nowhere? Now we're below it. We try to go below it, came above it, try to hold yep. it. Yep. Failed here, failed here, and now we're below it. Failing right here until it closes. We failed this halfback that we never tested. We should be going sweeping the downside. And we could sweep underneath this 200. That 200 is just a line. Yeah. Let, let's see what it did that last week. This an area. This three weeks. Let's see what it did here. Now this was that's why I say that this looked like a breakout period. I think because once it got above that, it was taking off. Um, to move some of these lines. Do let's do that 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 range right here, and let's see when it gets back in the range from that close. I bet you it goes back by the end of the week, too. Right there, it started breaking out, right? Let's see if that makes any sense. Let's see when it starts sweeping under. I think I got that right. So look, we held the low, 
came out, broke out. That's Monday, right? Came back to the top of it. Came back to it, and then we started breaking underneath. So this is where we're at right now. And look how it matches up with London's clothes. And we're doing it into a Tuesday, dog. All right, back to halfback. Mm -hmm. Halfback right here. And then we start sweeping the downside. Look, this is literally what we're looking at right now. Yeah, we're going to sweep the downside, dog. Swept all the way down here. Going into Friday, look where we went. Yeah, dogs, this thing's looking, uh, it's looking like it's going to make new lows. One, two, three. One, two. Three into Tuesday. Did the same range to the bottom side, dogs, to the week as it did to the top side. Right. Look at that. It did it all the way down to the downside. And it looks pretty much like it traded inside those ranges right here. Look into the next week. So when we challenge this area right here, right? We went to this area into Friday and we went all the way down to 58 on that Friday. Dead dogs. It looks like we're going to go lower because it's early in the week. Now, it, it's also depending where London clothes and all this stuff is at, too. But right now, we're kind of look at that and London's close is up there we're past 10 points of it too yeah we're way past London close uh, I got 39.84 39.84 and we're at 39.69 is more than 10 points 84.50 yeah it's over 10 yeah it's all this shit this is not going to hold up right here. It's out of range. Yeah, it's completely out of range. But can they try to get it back in range? I guess it's possible. This is the first attempt at halfback, though, still. So they could pop it back to London Close. They could pop it back up here. I mean, I ain't going to say they can't. I mean, 70, 80, that's 14. They can do 14. The difference between this week and they're, that they're week. still within range. They can do 14. Can we just go out of range and just continue to go? Yeah, we went out of Well, no, no. We, we play with the top side, guys. That's it. When we go back to that halfback, it usually just goes down. I mean, look right here. But we got to be underneath it, too. So that we're not. Yeah, that we're not. So that looks like this day right here. Yeah. Well, Tuesday was at the low. So this is the high. Of Friday's range. We're not there yet, I don't think, are we? What? Oh, what? Friday's range? Yeah, we're in the range. No, we ain't hit low of Friday's range. There, that was already hit the low of Friday's range. No, the low is down here, 39.54. Yeah. 39.54 is where we need to be going. Yeah, that's probably, probably the direction right now. <sighs> yeah, this thing's way overshot right now. So if we were to set up for tonight, I mean, this candle's humongous and we're way below it. Way below that candle. 
That candle looks crazy right now. Yeah, that range looks crazy, though. But we're at the bottom of the range again. But... But we, but we ain't left no free uh, 30 minute half backs either. So, it looks like we're going to test what score does. Half back and stage. And we're so, See, there's one, there's two. We'll touch that one. So, that resets. They got that one. They touched that one. Ah. Was London's what? And we're below, we're below London's open. Think yeah, about it. They did, they did another thing too, though, Dobbs, today. Look at the 1500 candle. This, all of this was after after the market ended. So this could be a squeeze. That's a huge box right there. Unless somebody got real heavy at the close, the, it got out of range completely. But that doesn't necessarily mean somebody probably went long completely. Yeah, somebody probably went long completely and then yeah because we're at the low of the day they're probably buying think about it. options is buying yeah and they sold it so they're gonna go down so they lose all right Dobbs, i am done for the night right. you trading right. tonight or no uh no nah, not tonight. i'm trying to rest getting tired i got you already hit the range on the bottom side too that's bad right there, Dobbs. We're at the low of London close range, you know that, right? Yeah. They're gonna send it right back into the range. I mean, not. I mean, it could just continue. It's a tough one. It's a tough one, right? The range is tiny, but the overall range for the week is staying down, so it could just continue. So unstoppable. I think that 67, 68 area is probably our line for tonight. All right, I am done for today. I will All catch right. you in the AM. All right, later. Later.